Hello and welcome back to our look at the Legends of Ilaria um, Early Access Me Barden. So the game has just recently been patched. Um, so apparently there's been a lot of bug fixes. So I'm hoping that um, that helps us here. Um, it's not helping us in terms of frame rate at the moment though. As you can see that's very low. Um, and I'm trying to find this bandit that I just killed. So I've been doing the, um, the maybe over here. I've been doing the um, kill bandits um, thing and I just noticed that I can inspect these bandits. So we're gonna do that, do that hopefully before anyone else comes. Um, so we've got some apples. Okay, and then we'll transfer the rest. So I was hoping that that would maybe be some kind of um, I was hoping it would be like some kind of advance to the story rather than just um, a bit of looting but um, I guess we'll just take what we can get so FPS is making it difficult though to target this guy there we go um, so I guess it's the same guy um, yeah so it looks like Either they're, they pooled their stuff or it was just, we can only target the one guy. Okay, now um, we need to put some more of this stuff down. So let's do that. Okay. Wow. That's what you get with the low frame rate. They just jump on you like that. Uh, can't, can't run the right way, look. <laughs> because I can't tell with the frame rate which way I'm actually going to go. So FPS definitely needs to be sorted out. Like, uh, there's no way at like two to four frames per second that you can actually play this game properly. So it's nice that they, they were fixing bugs, but uh, fixing you know, the spotty frame rate would be even better because um, if you want, if you want to have fun with the game, like look, these guys just popped out of nowhere. Look at that. Oh, and apparently, apparently I've died. I didn't see it, but apparently I died there, and I've lost resources. So we need to head on back there then. Yeah. So. Um, you know, Larkon Studios, please do something about this frame rate. You know, my PC isn't the most uh, modern, but at the same time, it's a decent enough PC, has decent graphics card and stuff, and uh, it should not be chugging along at two to four frames per second. At the least I'd expect to get um, on a game like this would be um, you know, 30, even if it is early access, like 30 frames per second. But yeah, we're going to have to head on back then that way. It's getting light now, so we can see a bit better. But at the same time, um, you know, th those guys can be on us before we know it. Simply because um, <laughs> we don't see them coming the frame rate okay so now they're popping in now so let's let's put this down and then get out of here Okay, and then let's put another one down. The next guy that comes along, and back off. You see more of them over the far side as well. Uh, he shouldn't survive. Oh, oh, there's more guys though. Okay, let's run this way and just track them through the rest of the fire. That one's gone. Okay, so. Let's 
head over in this direction. And then let's put one in the middle of the road. Okay, let's make it two. Oh, I think we made a three by accident. That should take care though of most of those guys. We seem so spirited around it, so let's run through it ourselves because we don't get damaged by the fire. Okay, that's done for him. Good. Okay, now I want to um, attract these guys over, so I've done that. Okay, so it looks like we can loot this guy over here because he's sparkling at least. Oh, look at this. Mm. This frame rate really is annoying. There we go, we can inspect them. Oh, look at that. Um, let's take the food because that's always useful. I didn't even drag it, look. Oh, well, I guess that's where it's gone now. I wanted to put it in there, though. Well, that can stay there, and then we can just transfer and accept that. Then as soon as we come out of this, we need to run. No, I said run. <laughs> yeah, please... <laughs> Please, please, please fix the faint frame rate. Okay, now, um, there are more guys we can loot. I guess we should get some looting done, seeing as we do need um, more gold to build our tavern. And these guys are happy enough, to, it seems, to provide some of the finances for that. Uh, but look at how ridiculously slow it is. Okay, let's, uh, let's take the apples. Okay, and then transfer that. Yep, we'll accept that. Now we can... Oh! Again, they just pop out of nowhere because of this frame rate. So let's um, put a spell down here. Okay, I killed him at least. So we should be able to inspect these guys. Uh, let's transfer everything. Just like that. So I'm guessing it's uh, maybe gold and then gold and then silver that these guys have. I hope it is at least. Okay, and uh, get some more apples. the guy that we just killed. Okay, let's transfer all of that. Okay, so some more guys there. And put down some fire and to play with. Oh. Again, I can't tell what the hell's going on. 
I'm trying to lead them in and out of the fire, but I can't because of the frame rate. I can't actually. Um, I can't actually time it right. So let's back off to right here. And then let's cast one there, then back off. And then we can cast another here. So this should kill the majority of these guys. Looks like the first one is taking almost all of them out. Yeah, the first one did for them, so let's make a way up. Then let's inspect these guys. Okay, we've got more apples. We'll take the apples. I don't like that. There should be something to tell you what that is, what those are. So I'm assuming it's gold and silver, but I'd like that to be, you know, it's confirm it, seeing as they're just symbols there. Let's um, accept that. How many find another guy that we can inspect? So this guy here should be different. Yes, let's transfer all. Okay, we'll take the apple as well. Okay. Or maybe we can't because he transferred all. That's probably what that is. How about some of the further away guys? Let's try that. And frame rate is terrible. Now, of course, um, I could just simply um, try maybe restarting a game or something, which I'm going to do in a second. But um, I want to keep stuff in like this because, um, you know, I want to be honest about this game. And if there are issues with the frame rate, then I don't want to be only recording when I'm getting you know, uh, 20 and 30 frames per second. I want to record like this and show people the kind of frustration that you're going to go through as well uh, with this game, pick it up at the moment. You know, you need to be aware really. So let's, um, so what I'm going to do now is, I think I'm going to uh, save now. So let's do that, save. Okay, it's taking a while to save as well. There we go, it's saved, okay. And then um, I'm going to stop my recording here, but then I, um, I'll start up a new recording once I come back into the game. So let me um, do that now. So I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we're back. So for a second, my frame rate went back up to 20 odd, and then now it's just gone down to two to four again. So I really don't know what the hell is going on with it, but I guess we're gonna to have to persevere. And the other thing as well is, look, I'm I'm now in like hand-to-hand -hand mode instead of having my spells, so. Okay, but at least um, it looks like I've been able to change the spell. And all of the guys that I killed have despawned. So here's a bunch more spawning in. Um, let's put this up because that guy is obviously a lot closer than I think he is. And let's put down another one. I'm going to sell us out of here. This is so frustrating. Um, let's transfer the money. Accept that. 
and then we move on. Oh, apparently, is it? Apparently, he was behind me and didn't even see. Him. Okay, well, let's um, loot him. So this looting system uh, has been added in the latest patch. That's why we're being it. We can loot these guys if I could target him. Oh, come on, game! What the hell? Oh, we got it for a second. Let's back up. Let's transfer all of that. Yeah, and this, you know, as I said, I want people to see the frustration involved in this kind of thing because, um, you know, some people, when they play a game and they, you know, they want the game to be successful, um, they think that that also means that they, they can't show anything critical about the game or, but, um, you know, if the game is going to be successful, it's because it's going to be a good game. And if there are things that are wrong with the game, then, you know, you have to point it out to people because um, otherwise what will happen is that, um, you know, you'll have all these people making videos saying, oh, the game is great. Uh, but, you know, people aren't stupid. Like when people go to play the game, if it's not as great as... Um, as people making videos have been making out, then, you know, they're not going to be happy about it. And it's going to be even worse for the game because, um, you know, people will have had higher expectations. So I'm trying to uh, help people set realistic expectations of this game. Uh, now, I want to continue on and find exactly where we're supposed to go for this so it's not the cave or I don't believe it's the cave um, so let's just head around the cave and try and get ourselves up here because I think those guys are actually related to the ambush of the um, the ambush of the patrol whose captain decided that um, he didn't want to come back to the town where we had the ability to um, to help him in terms of, you know, um, healing him and stuff. Rather, he'd rather stay in the cave um, and wait until he's rested enough to come back. So that doesn't really make much sense to me. Um, but let's make our way over here. So again, more bandit guys. Let's get, let's just get past those guys. So we want to get into the center clearing there and then we can put down some more. So right here, yeah. Oh look, there's, there's a chest there. I don't, well the last time I came, I think it was nighttime, so. Um, but I don't remember seeing the chest, um, so. Let's get a screenshot of all these chaps coming in to say hi. And let's get out of here because they'll obviously kill us. Okay, and yeah, come on, get over there. Let's open the chest and see what's in here. Okay, so we've got... Um, Nothing amazing, I have to say. That's, oh, somehow we managed to replace that. We didn't want to do that. Okay, let's pop that in there. Okay, um, let's swap you for you. Because I'm hoping that I can sell that stuff at some stage. Maybe I can't, but that's the hope. Okay, so we've opened the chest. Oh look, more guys. Okay, well. Oh, and they're definitely gonna kill me now. Okay, 
Okay, well, let's eat some of this. Put down another spell, because I'm sure more guys are just going to pop out of nowhere. Okay, I really want this quest to be over and done with, so that I don't have to deal with this shit. So let's, um, if we can, do some looting. Oh, there's the the sound coming back. So that bug isn't fixed where you lose your sound and come back randomly. I don't know what's going on with that, but um, definitely needs to be fixed. Okay, now. Um, so we killed a bunch of guys over there. Is there any way to get inside here? It's very hard to tell. Oh, there's a guy there. Look. Uh, well, let's. Welcome him. Oh, I don't think he can even get to us. Oh, this guy can now. He can help me out here. The quest just says kill enough of them and then they'll stop, but um, we're killing a ton of these guys and there's no stopping on the horizon, really. So this looks like somewhere where you go in and you kick the crap out of someone and then that'll be the quest done, but that's not what the quest says. The quest basically wants us to go over this way. Pretty much exactly here, where all these guys are. Apparently the same guy. I think when they die on each other, if they die too close to each other, you can't. It's difficult to access someone else. Okay, more guys dying. Yeah, they can get a few hits on if they want. Something's really going to matter in the long run. Let's put down some more magic fire and then let's loot this guy. We're making a decent um, bit of money off them, but at the same time, FPS plus glitched. Um, glitch mission is not good because, you know, how many of these guys are you supposed to kill? I've easily killed well over 100, probably over 200 at this stage. Let's 
strike some of these apples down here. Oh, more guys. Time to run. I think we're dead. But we're not dead. But again, they just pop out of nowhere. Let's put down another one of those and just eat some more apples. Okay, I think then we need some more. Okay, those guys are dead. There's another guy coming in. Um, what I'm gonna, I want to do some looting. Oh, now we need to get out of here now. But we can't. Wait. I think we just need to run and maybe head back home because it there's no way um, like there's no way that you're supposed to kill that many bandits on your own I know you could come with your militia and stuff but um, my militia guys just get themselves killed because they can't go into caves so I don't see a point in um, hiring militia at the moment. Okay, so we've got um, some goblins there. Yeah, so what are all the goblins doing? Is this... Oh, the goblins are attacking the village, I guess. Okay. Oh, they're gonna kill me. Yeah, goblins killed me. Okay, so back we go to our own village. And we lost some more resources. And look, it doesn't matter where you are. Like, the frame rate is just terrible. Select your destination. I would love to select my destination. Greenside, Greenside Mountains, Deep Mines, and that's it. So I'm sure at some stage the portals are going to be useful, but um, now is not the time, I don't think. Because I don't want to... Like, we're at, already at Greenside. So don't want to go to any of those places that it's um, prompting. Now, let's go back there to the mayor, our boss. Still don't understand how that works, but he seems to be the boss. And then see if we can get this quest done. Oh, and apparently there's a torch as well in here that we can use now since the last update. So let's pop in. Okay, so first let's go talk to him. We almost got into double figures there for frame rate for a second. Okay, now, let's see. About the bandits. Yes. I'm partly still working on it. You need to attack their main camp. If you dispatch enough of them, the rest of them will think twice before raiding our camps. Yeah, well, I can't believe that they could fit the amount of people that I've already killed into their camp. That is just crazy. Okay, anyway, I can help expand our town. I already paid them a visit, didn't I? 
What's going on there? We already did that last time. So I have to go and talk to them again. Okay. Well, let's go get the... Let's get the torch, which I believe is here. And I think, um, oh, we're walking through the lamp. Line. Now, where is the, maybe the chest is downstairs. Then. Yeah, it must be, okay. Uh, but I think that after this video, so, so far I've been putting one of these up a day, but I think after this video, um, it's probably going to, uh, where's the chest? Over here? No, oh, that's a chair. No, no chest there. Um, there's supposed to be a chest in here that we can get a torch from. Let's check a bit more thoroughly upstairs. But yeah, there's supposed, um, or yeah, what was I gonna say? Yeah, um, these are gonna become less often, I think, because um, of the state the game it's in, it's hard to actually play and enjoy it at the moment. So um, until things like, you know, um, so if I change now to once a week, at least like, you know, there should be progress happening. Um, it's early access, but the developer um, should be, I'd expect them to be patching at least once a week at this stage. But it's just difficult the way things are to, you know, have, um, like I, I, I really do want to play this game to enjoy it and to show it off. Um, but if I have to keep redoing the same missions, if I've got glitch, glitch missions and then I've got um, per frame rate, then um, it just doesn't make sense to me. So let's go to our journal. Okay, um, let's go to complete it and see. A new hope, first steps, search for food, a new hope. No, that's right at the back then. Let's, um, Sorry, frame rate means that it's difficult for me to actually close those. Okay, so active. Build a tower and kill the raiders. So we don't have that one active still. So we need to go back and talk to that guy again. I'm sure the bugs that got fixed uh, were annoying to you know the, the people who reported it and uh, I'd love to report some of these bugs if I could actually get um, access to the um, Larkon Studios forums. Um, still having trouble with that. Um, I might send a tweet and see if we can get one of the uh, devs maybe to respond and to sort out my access because you can see just tons of bugs uh, that need to be sorted for this game. And I hope there are actually people reporting him. So we need to head back in to him. Okay. Right, so give us the mission to go and talk to the people. Actually give it to us. Okay, Brad Greenside. Anyway, I can help around the town. Okay, know about the village. Okay, all right, let's see what I can do. Anything else? Never mind. Okay, now, journal. Still not there. It's still not in my journal, and it's not in my completed. Well, I'm gonna go to the village anyway. 
Um, I kind of roughly know where it is, as I said, roughly. Because we killed all those stupid bandits for them as well the last time. And cleared them all out. So we're going to have to do that again, I guess. And like there were goblins and stuff as well. So let's just get a move on here. So as I said before, and I'll mention it again here, just for anyone who's thinking of purchasing the game, you know, um, if you're paying the, I think now it's 20% uh, discount is gone. So you're looking at um, 20 euros to buy this game. And if you're paying 20 euros for this game, uh, this is what you're paying for, you know, um, low um, FPS, bugged missions, um, you know, a lot of the features that should, will be in the game, not there at the moment. Um, that's what you're buying. You know, you're not buying um, all of the promise that's in the game. What you're doing is you're taking a gamble on the fact that um, when that the developer is going to be able to um, deliver on that promise. But you're not actually getting that game for your 20 euros. You might get it some some way down the line, but um, there is absolutely zero guarantees that that is what will happen. So just, you know, just be aware. Oh, we're getting attacked again. Okay. So let's get ourselves over here. Look, I can't even steer myself to get in through this. Yeah, I knew I was gonna overrun it. I'm gonna die again because I, I can't see what I'm doing. There's more than coming. Yeah, I'm stuck, look. I'm just gonna die again. Because there's nothing I can do. Let's go over here. Then let's cast some magic. Oh, look. We've lost. No, we haven't. No, that was, that was me being stupid. I was going to say we lost it, but we hadn't. What actually happened was... I forgot to go into battle mode. Okay. It's got a cave there. But I want to get to the village, so. Okay, let's put this up. Then let's switch to that if we need it. Sound's gone again. We still got the delay. You know, a lot of this, you know, whatever bugs are being um, corrected, again, like just the, the basic gameplay needs to be sorted out you know this input delay um the whole thing with um the frame rate you know um please do something about that kind of stuff okay getting shot at again Get ourselves in here. Oh god, I can't even steer around the door because of the the frame rate. Oh look, we've got a guy here. Okay, well. Let's eat some, some apple. Okay, inside we go. It's certainly interesting um, what's here, but the same 
time. Um, I can't really enjoy it. She's got more shooting. This guy's right over here. Okay, so let's put this down. So they're coming through. They seem to be coming through that port. Let's kill this guy and then I think I'm going to end the video. Yeah, look, that's must be what those guys are doing. They're going through this port. So there's probably some... Um, some mission we can do that will allow us to close that portal off and stop them coming through. Yes. Uh, transfer and accept that. Okay, let's see what the goblins have. Apparently nothing on that guy. Let's try the next guy. Yeah, I'm just gonna have to move out of here. Ugh, again. Frame rate just is not my friend. So see a goblin dudes, but um, I'm gonna do a runner. And head over in this way, this direction. Okay, that should leave us at a safe distance. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm probably still gonna play this offline um, myself, just to progress, so that when we come back, uh, you know, got something different maybe to show you. Um, and let's put this down because apparently we're not far enough away. But yeah, I play this myself without recording probably and then um, when we come back probably next week um, come back and have another look and see you know how it's progressed because um, just right now um, you know even compared to before this patch um, it's less playable I think so obviously to fix some stuff but there's still a lot just said it before there's so much um wrong with the game at the moment that it's just really hard but that's that's early access for you like you know it's not kind of unique to this game it's it's just what early access is um but you know i hope at least this has been informative for you and um apparently we're still getting shot but yeah i hope this you found this informative and um you know this helps you to make your decision if you haven't already picked up the game and i also hope in the future to be able to um, bring you more more videos and more information on the game and hopefully um ones showing you know the improvement over time of the game um i don't feel that's happened in this patch um maybe if if i was on a different stage of the game i would feel that way but right now um, I have to be honest and say I don't feel like the patch has improved the game at all uh, from my standpoint. But um, that is the end of this particular video. So if you have enjoyed, please consider liking, subscribing, sharing, and perhaps posting a comment. And I really do hope to see all of you next time. Goodbye.